Hello there, this is 8 feet under and 8. Today we're playing Dread Testing Area. So, today this video is pretty much just another, just an extension on yesterday's video, or an update to it, I guess. Because yesterday, yesterday's video was just about things that are in the testing area that are most likely going to be in Dread 1.13. So, first thing was a circular health bar. I mean, it is a circle, but then it is a circle in the main in the main game right now. But then, instead of going uh, draining around the circle, it drains down. It drains just straight up and down in the circle. So now it's drained circular, which is pretty nice. It looks a bit more aesthetically pleasing. And speaking of aesthetically pleasing things, you see this hot bar here. Yesterday. I was making, doing my opinions on it, or, or I don't know, explaining it. I said that it did not look very good because, well, it was a bit bigger than today. Than today, it, it's a bit bigger than it was today, and it, it was also the weapon images did not match. There was some that were just an image of the actual weapon that was in color, and they were different sizes. But now, they're all this nice white, this white cutout over a d nice dark gray background, and they turn blue. And all these these three colors they match very well. And, mm -hmm, everything about this little menu is very nice and aesthetically pleasing. The only thing that I would change about it, if I had the chance, is I would make it a bit smaller. Mm -hmm. The only reason I would do that is because if you're in first person and you're Getting out your secondary, and I don't know if you're the zomb if you're surrounded by the zombies, then it's it, it's a little bit distracting, but it's not a big problem. It's and that feeling. It's just mm -hmm, what I would change about it. I don't know. It's not. It's not a problem. It's it's fine the way it is. But then that's the only thing I would change about it because. Anyway, that wraps it up for this video. Thank you for watching. See you next time.